is Lobo. At present, I am working at Sacred Heart Church Asanwari in Khanapur. I am an ex-polite and I want to speak on dedication leads to success. The life of St. Francis Xavier stands as a testament to the power of dedication. As we reflect on his journey, we are reminded that success is born out of unwavering commitment. Often in our daily pursuits, we encounter challenges that may lead to discouragement. It's in these moments that the example of saints like St. Francis Xavier becomes a guiding light. Born on 7th April 1506 in a royal family of Spain, he grew up in royal lifestyle. He got the best education and became a lawyer. He too, as you, had dreams of enjoying the pomp and glory of the world. But God had other plans for him. In his pursuit of studies, St. Francis Xavier encountered St. Ignatius of Loyola, who attempted to persuade him to serve the church as a missionary. However, this attempt proved unsuccessful, as Francis was initially more inclined towards worldly desires. The impactful words of St. Ignatius, What does it profit a man if he gains the whole world but loses his very own soul, eventually brought about a transformation in St. Francis's life. Finally, in 1534, a profound transformation occurred in the life of St. Francis Xavier. He took the vow of poverty and celibacy, dedicating himself to spreading the teaching of Jesus Christ. Alongside with Ignatius of Loyola, St. Peter Fabian, St. James, St. Alphonsus, St. Nicholas and St. Simon, St. Francis Xavier co-founded the Society of Jesus. He now is known as the Jesuits. Ordained as a priest on June 24, 1537, he served in various places of Italy. Yet a calling within him urged him to go beyond and preach the message of Jesus. In 1542, he set out to preach and arrived in India, specifically in the Portuguese-occupied area of Paravas. There he spent three years with pearl fishers, a community of baptized Christians lacking adequate spiritual guidance. Francis dedicated himself to catechize the people, especially children. His resonance steamed from unwavering dedication to his task of spreading the gospel of Jesus. As a proud alumni of St. Paul's High School, belonging to the Diocese of Belgaum, I can attest to the transformative power of dedication. The lesson learned from the Jesuits' fathers and teachers, along with the principles and lifestyle instilled at the St. Paul's High School, have guided me throughout my life. Today, I am a successful priest and the values imparted during my formation years continue to shape in my journey. St. Francis Xavier's life teaches us the importance of dedication in pursuing meaningful goals. Let us dedicate our lives to the gospel values and prayers. For married couples, dedication to each other is paramount. As parents, let us dedicate ourselves to the respectful, disciplined and healthy upbringing of our families. As you, let us dedicate our lives to the betterment of our careers and society. And as children, 
let us dedicate ourselves to studies and achieving the right goals in life. Our dedication has the power to transform not only ourselves but also our society and nation as a whole. St. Francis Xavier, whose feast we celebrate and whose uncorrupted body rests in our land, serves as an enduring example of dedication. His success is evident in the venture on and visits he receives from thousands. Thousands of people from all over the world, irrespective of caste and creed, visit the holy shrine of Bon Jesu to pray homage to the holy relics of Saint. These visitors receive constant healing and come back year after year to pray to the saints and as an act of thanksgiving. In the spirit of Saint Francis Xavier, let us also dedicate our lives to a noble goal, to be better humans. May our dedication contribute to a brighter and more compassionate world for all. Thank you for joining us on this journey of inspiration and learning.